This is a young boy, he's 11 years old, and he's a really good golfer. And he's been having pain on the inside of his foot that's been going on for a really long time. We're gonna go in and remove these little pieces of bone on the inside of the foot called an accessory navicular. <clears throat> is this gonna be bad for my image that Justin Bieber's playing? <clears throat> I'm not ashamed to say it, I like me some Justin Bieber. <laughs> His foot is pointing down this way, the heel is up here, and my pointer is right on this little bone right there is an accessory navicular. You can almost see it's got kind of an abnormal joint to connect it to this bone called the navicular. So this thing is just causing him a lot of trouble. We're just going to go in and remove it. This is going to be uh, like kind of taking a pebble out of the shoe, and once he recovers, his pain should resolve. And we're just going to expose this bone. So we're going to take a picture. My freer is kind of in between the real navicular and the accessory navicular. His actual navicular is a little prominent there, so since we're here, I'm going to trim that back just a little bit. I want to make sure that feels nice and smooth. Let's see what it looks like on x-ray. Compared to the initial one, the accessory navicular is missing. So that's gone, and now what's important is that it looks just like a navicular. It doesn't look like an abnormal, it just looks like a regular navicular, and that's what we want. We should, we should be back on the golf course in the next six to eight weeks, if not sooner. Picture. Okay, you can see that one not as well because it's hiding behind the calcaneus. Part of the attachment is on the bone, the navicular. We're just sort of shelling out this part of the bone on the inside of the tendon. And then when we repair the tendon at the end, it'll heal. Some people, the bones don't fuse and they're left with like a little piece called an accessory navicular, which in most cases is not painful. It's just a difference. But in some people, it's painful. So in this boy, if we take him out and he'll do fine. We just went out and excised uh, both of them on both sides through tiny little incisions that we closed with a nice little plastic surgery closure. He's a real avid golfer and he's very good at it. He was actually referred to us by a professional golfer that I know. And uh, we're going to have this kid back out on the golf course shooting low scores in uh, the next six to eight weeks. See you next time at Barber Orthopedics.